Hi, and welcome to today's video on the Lightspeed Privacy Pop-Up Tent. This is one of the items that we've added to our minivan camper um, kit. And this is what we consider a must-have. The minivan camper is rather small and having a privacy tent allows you to be able to change your clothes in there and take a shower and use um, a little portable toilet in there. So now we're going to set up the light speed and you'll see how quick that it goes together. All right, now I'd like to give you a little demo of the things that we've learned after taking it out um, a couple times, our camper with our privacy tent. And so what we have found were some valuable things to add to it and for our setup. Okay, so here's the inside. Got two zipper flaps that you can open up here should you want to. Um, it's got the packet pocket there. We have one of these little lanterns that at night when we come in, we use the hook that's up here To hang the lantern, then you've got nice light coming from the top to see. This hook up here also is used for our shower. And in this bag, I have all of the our privacy tent materials. Got the bag with our toilet paper and wipes. Our two river leaf microfiber towels and our Sea to Summit pocket shower. Now you would think that this is very, very tiny. But as you can see, it's actually quite large. And so you can fill it with water up to the fill line is right there. And you can hang it out in the sun to heat up, or you could heat up some water on your camp stove to so it's warm, add a little cool water if you need to because you don't want to scald yourself. Then you would fold it down. Hook it, and I would use a car carabiner and hang it from your hook. You just simply pull down to shower. This particular water bag is a bit more expensive, but we felt it was worth the price because it also doubles as a dry bag, so you could use it when you're kayaking or canoeing to keep things dry, then you can also use it when you're done camping to put your wet suit, some wet towels in there, and just fold it up, snap it, throw it into your laundry. We also have a little tiny, it's very easy pop up with handles laundry basket that we keep in here. You just you use this as your changing room. You just toss your dirty clothes in there. When then when we're done, you just toss this in the back seat. 
You get home, you just grab it by the handle, take it right to the laundry, do your laundry, take it right back out, put it back in the camper, you're ready for your next trip. That in this bag, I said there's our toilet tissue and our wipes. And these fit just perfectly in these two little pouches here. If you put the toilet paper in like this, it just slides straight down. There's the remaining part of our shower system. I have a little packet in here with hair tie. My microfiber towel, a little bag with uh, shower puff and soap, and a comb. All fits in this little bag that the soap, that the towel came from. This is a very nice sized towel, 24 inches by 48 inches, microfiber, fast dry. So when you're done, just slip it. on the hanging strap back there and dry your towel. Finally, in this packet, we have our toilet. And that also holds the toilet bags. And we, we found that it's best if you change out your bag every single day. So you set the toilet there. After the last time, Mark built out of some scrap wood, just a square, it's got this little lip on it, so it makes it as easier to grab as a handle. And we put on an adhesive deodorizer. So that would go right on top of there. Uh, keeps the smell down and flies, etc. And then the final thing that we found, and this may seem really crazy, but because of the size of it, and at night you're not always on a level surface, so you're kind of in here, and there's really not, you know, it, there's nothing to grab onto. So if you kind of, it's on stable ground, you don't have much to grab onto, and the last thing that you want to do is go falling into the side of the tent. So we discussed what were ways that we could add something that we could hold on to. You couldn't really add grab. We were thinking grab bars. Well, how do you add grab bars to a tent? And we came up with a genius plan. And what we purchased was this walker. Selected this walker for a few reasons because it had the bent handle on it and it's adjustable height. So you just slip this in there, right behind the toilet. Now you've got something to grab onto when you're standing back up, sitting down, uh, you're changing your clothes, you have something to grab onto. You also have the piece of wood on top of there, so you can put your foot on there, tie your shoes, etc. It may seem crazy, but it uh, probably it's probably one of our most brilliant um, additions to our setup. There you have our little world, our setup of our privacy toilet room, and keep on camping and making memories one campsite at a time.